Hey, hey. Hi, guys. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Thank you guys so much for clicking in. Look at this. We're not all uh, dark colors and beanies. We're sometimes we can be a little ray of sunshine. Um, wanted to do things a little differently today. I today is normally supposed to be a comp series Overwatch day, but since there's a lot more of you guys now, which honestly I'm not complaining, but I really wanted to kind of make it a little bit more, more cohesive as a channel and really figure out the direction I wanted to go as far as consistency and and uh, video content and something that I've really loved that's also in my bio is how much I love survival games so I thought we'd do something a little bit more consistent and I looked around out there for any type of you know survival games that not a lot of coverage is on and it seems like, you know, Grounded could be an up and coming. I mean, it's been out in the works for a while and I've played it before, but I played it when it was in like real beta. Like it, it was, didn't really have a lot in there and I definitely never completed it. So it seems like there's some new dialogue out. There's some new stuff out, but with, with what you guys have been saying as far as like how awesome the Valheim series has been um, and how much support you guys have been giving it and how much more traction that's bringing at least to the channel, I really wanted to kind of do something more, you know, again, consistent. Um, and so I wanted to bring you guys a new playthrough for Grounded and a new series starter. So we're going to actually be doing this probably consistently for a long time. Um, there are still some survival games out there that I haven't yet you know, scratched the surface of. One of which is being Ark, the next being Rust. I also haven't tackled all of Subnautica, but everyone's played Subnautica. So I felt like I wanted kind of to change it up and I wanted to give something that, you know, that not a lot of people maybe have out there. And, you know, we have uh, arachnophobia people out there, people that physically cannot tolerate spiders and I don't really I don't actually mind them too much so I thought that this would be really fun if this is your first time clicking in thank you so much I really appreciate the love and support and let's do this I've never actually I don't think played this game without friends it's definitely like a friend game like you should play it with your with your buddies that's kind of the point but it seems like everything in this game is pretty much scaled to make sure that you, even if you're as a single player, have a really good experience. So, this should be really interesting. Um, let's go ahead and do a mild, I'm sorry, a uh, medium, because we're uh, not a bunch of babies. I don't understand why you would play a game that's meant to be played with bugs as a survival game. Like, it'd be like Seven Days to Die, that game that just came out, it's the zombie survival game. It'd be like playing that game with no zombies. Why would you do that? <laughs> I guess maybe to like get some captive gameplay or something like that, maybe. Um, I want to do hoops, but Pete just looks so lovable. Let's let's let's. Ah, uh, we'll do hoops. It's whatever. Alley hoop. Oop. You can't run from me, you foul beast. <laughs> you oh, this is now. Right, okay, so they added new, like, dialogue and, and a bunch of new stuff in here, so I'm excited to get it going. Good morning, Brook Hollow. Today is October 20, 1990. This is your news. We have a special breaking report. The police 1990? information that more local teenagers have gone missing. They were last seen earlier this week, and the only connection between the teenagers Ooh, is that they are spooky. At Brook Hollow this is cool. I like the changes. The, the animation's also really cool as well. From our other <clears throat> quiet town. If anyone has seen the teenagers or has any other information, all of this looks like you can... I wonder if we can get inside the house now. That would be fun. Can you even get past a lot of this stuff? I wonder if you can even access this part of the map.
volume is definitely outrageously loud, the music volume. I'm like monitoring it on the side and I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> also, what crazy scientist weirdo would kidnap a bunch of kids and shrink them down, you know? I'm very interested in the story. It's very captivating. Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, part two. You know, this is uh, gonna sound crazy. May make a lot of people mad, but I have actually never seen Honey, I've Shrunk yeah, the, I've shrunk the Kids. Shrunk the Kids. Hey. <sighs> Where am I? What the heck is this place? Everything seems so big. Whoa. Or am I really, really small? Is it already getting to be nighttime? The hell? No, maybe it's just dark in this little crack here. That's a quick little fella. <laughs> kind of cute, too. It just looks so beautiful on the Xbox as well, like the, the new console. Okay, we're learning some of the. Gotta relearn all the mechanics. It's fun. Oh my gosh. Mother. This is getting real. You've got this, Hoops. The sound design is already freaking me out. <laughs> it's just so loud. Let's get on top of this. Alright, so... I don't love the aspect of having to constantly watch is the key to your hunger and your water intake. It's always kind of a chore a bit. Or it feels like. But... There's nothing you can do about it, so we might as well go with the flow. Wait, how do I... Oh, interesting. Okay, cool. And then what do I do? Oh, easy, easy. Okay, we've got this. This is gonna be easy. Ah! Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I, do, I don't have a weapon. How do I... Yeah. I... What? What do I do? I don't have anything! Okay. <laughs> that was not necessary, but okay. I already thrown me some curveballs. I guess I got a little too close to the, the mites area. It's like relearning a whole new muscle. I have no idea <laughs> how, to, how anything works. Before it becomes nighttime, we might need to do something about uh, about this. I'm guessing this isn't the only one of these science pods. I should keep searching and see what else I can turn up. Science. science. I remember that. So the point of this game, for those who may not know, just in case you don't know, the idea is to get big, obviously. So you gotta figure out how to unshrink yourself, which is really cool. Um... It's definitely a game you want to play with friends, like I like I mentioned before, but it's just going to be us. Us in a dream. I also wasn't the person who ended up <laughs> doing a lot of the story when I did play with friends for the few times I did. I never really played the story aspect. One, probably because there wasn't a lot of story yet, and I think they were trying to re-voice some of the voice lines so they were trying to redo some of them and but when i did play with friends my friends actually were the ones who kind of advanced more of the storyline and i just kind of stayed back and built a bunch of stuff so that was my job it was just a build so i don't i'm a little lost when it comes to what we're actually supposed to be doing and with them kind of updating the game you know i'm gonna just be lost in the sauce here <laughs> Oh my god! I hadoukened it! Oh my gosh, you can turn off any of this stuff at any time? A pet invincibility? I can have pets? What does this game come to? Oh yeah, they, they kind of upgraded a lot of the interface for like... Okay. Like building menus, so now it's up on the d-pad. Let's build a little f Oh gosh, we can't build anything. What are we doing? Close. LT to unload. Oh, easy. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Alright. Let's put that there. We're gonna need to do something before it becomes dark time. Alright. 
So what if I do this and do this and then I do this and I analyze this? Can I start building structures now? <laughs> yes! Sorry. Yes! Okay, I need to get some water in me. Oh my god, ant! <laughs> he just walked over all my stuff! Alright, so they're supposed to be facing out like this, like so. Easy enough. Let's put that there. How do how, they auto lock or what? What's, what's going on here? Okay. Cool. Keep out all the spiders. Because you know they're coming. I don't know where, but they are. The auto lock is so nice in this. Like. Oh my god, that scared me. Coming from a game like Valheim. That ladybug would be a menace boxing out in the paint. Yeah, no kidding. Um, coming from a game like Valheim and the auto locking feature on that. Like, the game's cool. But the auto lock sucks. I think I'm trying to like sprint before I can crawl. Is that the is that the phrase the saying? I was trying to run before I can walk. And that's fine. That's fine. There's no problem in doing something like that. Oh my gosh. We're out. Uh, ah! No, we're not. Okay. I'd say this is a pretty solid start so far. I like that it's just pinging a ton of resources on our map already. <laughs> it's like, hey. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna survive this, actually. I'm not, like, scared of- I'm not, like, super intolerable of spiders, but, like... Doesn't mean I want to see one right now. Like, give me a bow, or give me some protection at least, and then maybe I could take a spider on. Alright. It's a pretty good start. I just feel <sighs> so much better. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. There's some water right there. Should I risk it? No? Is it this one? There you go. Is that a basketball court? Mm, nice try. Definitely not even close, but... A for effort. Um, we'll interact with this maybe when the sun goes up. Because I don't really want to mess with it now. I kind of just want to get some resources. Again, I was the builder. I was not the explorer. Or the advance the storyliner. -er. Ah! Yeah, I'll sleep. I think that'll help. Maybe. Storage basket. Let's put all this storage baskets right here. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna need that many, but I'm assuming I do. There are so many ladybugs. <laughs> Why are there so many ladybugs? I feel like when I played it the for the first time, there definitely was not this many ladybugs before. I'm using the first time I played it as like a good comparison, but I think I played it over like almost two years ago. It feels like. It's it's definitely been a while. Need those. I don't know how to get them though. The game keeps pinging me on something. Go home, investigate the mysterious machine, craft a torch, craft a piece of armor. Yep, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. It's a lot of at once. It feels like. Um, let's maybe activate the machine now. <laughs> Ooh, light Joe. Aw, it didn't work. Looks like one laser is blocked. All right, short it out, blocked. Oh, easy. Well, we could just unblock here. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. The game is really definitely generous in the in the beginning. It's like, hey, I know this is kind of confusing. This seems like a lot. Don't worry, it is. <laughs> but we'll. Will hold your hand. Have I ever told you guys I'm a very quick study, very quick learner? I guess it helps that I played the game, but I like pride myself on it. I better be a ladybug, I swear. This is usually around. Yeah, it sounds like a little ladybug. Little. They're not really little, <laughs> they're pretty freaking huge. 
Every storage unit needs its own thing. Oh, I can't stack more than five. Okay. Dude, I have so much inventory space. Am I doing this right? Is this real survival? I do not remember this being an option. Like, I don't remember having this much space for some reason. Um, let's see what kind of armor we should craft. So we can do... Oh, we need leaf covers, leaf covers, leaf covers. Okay, we need leaf covers right now. Before any more bugs come out. That did not look friendly. So, da, 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 da. Ah, I keep getting stuck on everything. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. We will stay away from that. That did not look good. I didn't have to hear him to know it was a spider. Or, I'm sorry, I didn't need to see him to know it was a spider. All right, so now we can make some armor. Let's craft one of these. Wait, a gas mask? You could already make a gas mask? I didn't flip any type of switch. I didn't flip the give me everything immediately switch. Um, doesn't give me much armor, but it's all right. I mean, it's all right. Aw, oh, yeah, look at us. Look at our hoop. <laughs> I grew up so fast. Okay, I think we're doing pretty good. You can move stuff like that. How do I, I just don't know how to repair something that's damaged. Oh well, that sounds like a problem for another day. What? Can't sleep until 20 minutes. <laughs> 20 in-game minutes, that's too long. Look at this beautiful, beautiful home that we've created <laughs> already. Thanks for joining me on this episode of Grounded. I hope you guys liked it. And if you found some of this entertaining, just even in the slightest, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like on this video and you consider subscribing. It's all you can ever ask for. If you want some more survival content, please consider doing so and all those other fun things we talked about. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Mwah.